Hello friends, uh, welcome again and uh, this is my new project book sales and inventory system and I have developed this project in uh, Java JSP and MySQL and the version for the JDK I am using is the JDK 1.8 and Tomcat server I am using is the 9 also uh, uh, MySQL version is 5.6 for connecting Java with JSP with MySQL I have used MySQL connector which you will get easily from the mysql.org website this is a web-based application so for developing uh, ui and front-end part i have used html css and javascript some of the jquery library also i have used like for form validations creating calendar and date plugins right i have used a jquery so these are the technology stacks which i have used for developing this project book sales and inventor system right so let's start with the functionality go through that what we have developed in it what the modules are there in the project right so this is the home page of the project this is a static home page and this is a single user based login that is admin means the main concept and then main objective for developing this project is to uh, manage the sales of the books in a shop and also manage the inventory of the books right that how much sale the shopkeeper has done right so that this is the main objective uh, for developing this project so this is the home page of the project this is about us this is again a static page there is nothing dynamic on it this is admin login and it's a dynamic page and the user id and password is getting validated from uh, database right if you don't have the user id and password then you will not be able to log in this is a contact us page this is a static contact us page and and i am not saving the value of this contact us page anywhere into the database right so even i am not sending any type of email and sms from this page so I am going to log in as an admin. So the user ID is admin and the password is test. So once you log inside the system, then you will get this dashboard. So admin can perform these operations, what is mentioned on the dashboard, <coughs> right? So admin can add the books, admin can add the cell, admin can check the all book reports and sales report, right? Even the same menu is available here in the header bar also, right? You can see this is a stock report option extra from where you will be able to see all of the stocks for all of the books right so let me go through one by one so home i already explained you about us i already explained you dashboard so this is the dashboard and this dashboard add reports this menu will only and only be appear when admin is login right if admin is not login then this menu will be not will not be appeared because this is session driven menu <coughs> right if I log out from the system, then you will not be able to see the ad, uh, administrative options, right? But if I log inside the system, then you will be able to see the administrative options. So this is a session driven dynamic menu. This is ad book from here. You will be able to add the book. So this is a book is a product, right? So here you can select the product. This both of the drop down is totally dynamic and the value of this drop down is coming from the database. If you want to change the value, if you want to insert update, then you can do. do uh directly from the database right so you can add the book here this is add sales from here you will be able to add sales so here you need to enter the customer name first right and then the mobile number of the customer right once you click on the start order then you can see the this is dashboard what we have prepared this is the order id right this is the order date this is the customer name customer mobile right and from this drop down you will be able to select the book which is available in your system right so you will be able to add the uh, select the books and the quantity right all things will be calculated automatically right you can see this is the math books quantity 3 price per unit is 250 and total amount is 750 right you can delete it also once you click on the delete then item will be deleted from the cart not from the database only from the cart right so i have added one book i have added second book this drop down will contain all of the book which you have added right so i have added the third book right with the quantity three right so once you uh, added all the uh, books then this is the quantity and this quantity will be deducted from the main stock right once you click on the save sales then this whole page will be saved into the database you can see this is the receipt you can print this receipt on clicking on the print receipt right this is the add sales part this is a report all books report right you can see this is the all books report 
total stock you can see this is a stock and it will be decreased after your sales right suppose if you have sold computer book five computer book to a customer then five items will be deducted from this total stock right this is item this is a totally uh, smart table you can search the book here you can see this is the searching is working right you can copy it csv import export into the csv into excel into pdf into print so this all uh buttons are working this pagination is working you can sort the book name you can see it's sorting right so this is a totally smart table this is a sales report all of the sales which you have done will be displayed here so you can see there are two cells we have done Right. once you click on the view details then you will be able to see details of the cells right this is a stock report right all of the uh, books and with their stocks how many stocks are remaining right so this is the stock report so that's why the project title name is book sales and inventory system this is an inventory and still this is a sales i already showed you right so new right so these are the reports for all of the things this is a logout Right. Once you log out, then your session will be destroyed and you will not be able to access the administrative menu. So these options, we have developed these functionalities. We have developed inside this project, book sales and inventory management system. If you need more functionality in this project, just put it into the comment. I will incorporate the changes. I will make this project more better and better according to requirements. And don't forget to subscribe our channel for getting the latest projects videos on the latest technologies. Thanks for watching the video. Thank you very much.